Hello, audience, and welcome to the Guild of Adventure side quest, the Divers of the Caribbean. My name is Isaac Gutierrez, and I'll be playing Mickey Mouse, a warforged that speaks with a terrible Scottish accent. Uh, then with me, as always, will be Marcus as Convos, the Triton captain of our ship. And finally, the ever intelligent to clever DM, Jacob as God. And we all welcome you to the Guild of Adventure side quest. Please enjoy. All right, so we're heading over to the island. Yeah, so you guys take your rowboat and you, you go up to the edge of the uh, island and pull it ashore. So that it won't get chewed up. Chewed up. All right. I want to go check on the other boat. See what they got in there. Yeah. All right. So uh, running over to the boats, they're kind of pulled up. Uh, they, they have like um, so inside there seems like simple brown cloaks, um, and strangely enough. Alongside, um, the the wood is kind of smooth. Uh, they're they're quality rowboats, and there's these like small like suction rings, all over like the seats and stuff. All over the seats. Weird, weird. <laughs> okay. Is it their ass? Their asshole? Are they? <laughs> are they? <laughs> <laughs> is it just Squidward? All right, what's in the boats? Just. Okay, That's it. Suction. So there's there's a little brown cloak uh, in one of them, and then there's these little suction cups. Huh. Well, I guess we're gonna fucking steal these boats on our way out, but for now. Yeah, and I'm gonna grab the cloak and put it on. Alright. Smart. You smart. put on the cloak. I put up my cloak, which may or may... Actually, my cloak is brown, so it does kind of blend in a little bit. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Let's see. Can we find some tracks? Yeah. We... Survival? Yeah. Survival. Go for it. Uh, unnatural 20. Yeah, I'm you see, again, these kind of weird... You, you see some, like, humanoid footprints mixed in with these weird suction... Mm, this prints, is weird. And they lead around the island. Uh, I would like to follow them fast, because I'm worried about this chick. Alright, you guys follow the tracks. You walk around the island, and uh, before long, the tracks simply stop. And looking around, you see in the distance another small boat bobbing in the water. For a second, you think it's yours, but then you realize it's not. Uh, the sail is unfurled, so you assume the anchor is down. Uh, and the icon on the sail, uh, it's a an eye, a purple eye with a yellow iris. Oh, no. Isaac knows what this is. Isaac is not cool with this. You do? I do, because that's... I know that's homebrew. That, oh, that symbol, it, it means beholders and mind flayers. Oh, it does. Yeah, that's a that's a D and D symbol. Oh crap. <laughs> that's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll change that. Uh, but yeah, that, I was thinking, <laughs> my God, are we gonna fight fucking pirate mind flayers? Like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, that would have been so funny. Uh, oh. Okay. All right, but um, oh, how do convos? Do you think we steal that ship? But if we like hook it up to your other one with some rope and just pull? Yes, all the ships we can get. <laughs> What if we just say fuck that guy's wife and just take the ship? I think we're here now. You know, let's, we, <laughs> we might as well and, since we're here. And plus, she got a pearl necklace that we could probably take for ourselves. If she's dead, you're right. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's. Um, should we go uh, to that boat and kill anyone on it first? Wait, send your uh, send your bird out to oh. scout while we hide out. Hey, Percy, sure no go check out the boat, please. Hey, I'm going to duck behind a tree. And uh, yeah, I'll duck right. behind a tree as well. And he takes off and flies towards the boat. Um, so as you guys sit here, kind of up on this little ledge with these trees, looking down at the beach, out, on, uh, out the water towards the ship, you notice something. Um, right up against the edge of the water, um, kind of... It, it, it's kind of like a, a short cliff, uh, mm. maybe only five feet tall. And bubbling up from there, you see the water kind of turns a faint red. Wow. <laughs> and these little purple squids swarm towards it. The boat? The boat? No, the, the, this, um, the, the water up against the shore oh. turns red and the fish thing swim towards it. Oh, like it? Oh, it's our, Oh, towards the bubbling. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. And your bird says, your bird flies back and says, all right, no one there. On the ship. No one on the ship. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Well, let's go, uh, let's watch that bubbling. I want to see what the bird, the, the, the fish are doing. Yeah, so you watch it, uh, and they kind of, they, they kind of like diving around. There, there's, before long, there's hundreds of them. Uh, it's the water's thick with them here. Uh, and is then, it a person in there? Uh, do you want to go over and take a closer look? Yes, please. Um, you walk over and the water is red and kind of misty. Uh, occasionally you might see a, a chunk of a, some red, uh, substance. Um, it, but it, that's it. it. Um, the, the, I hope to God that wasn't his wife. <laughs> I, I hope not either. We're, we're going to be screwed out of 500 gold in a boat. Well, well, well we're going to take boat. their boat. We don't really need his shitty boat. Um... But I don't think that's why. Let me see. Do I have because I, I have technically some cleric spells. I think something like that. Hold on, let me check. What I got? Shield, sanctuary. Uh, nope. Oh, I thought I might have had something to tell if it was her. Like, uh, nope. Never mind. Uh, before long, the water fades back into kind of a clear ocean blue, and the squid things start to depart. And as you're still staring down into uh this area where they all were swarming you realize the rock seems to kind of pull away and extend under the island uh almost like an underwater cave ha huh. come on boss. come Ooh. on down here yeah i go running come on boss. i think i think we can swim underneath the cave because they're parked right in front of the cave uh what if we do a distraction toss some food and I can cast Sanctuary on us, and we can just swim for a minute. I think that'd be a good idea. Sanctuary would keep those little bastards off of us. It would. Mm. Uh, I like to, like, uh, I'm gonna, like, do that thing where you lay on the edge of a cliff, and then uh, I'm gonna, like, try to use my robot legs to dig my feet into the dirt and try to see if I can, like, slightly hang myself off the cliff and see if I can make a perception check at, like, what's deeper inside the little area. Uh, it seems to just extend. It, it's, it gets pretty dark, uh, and then it seems to go back up. After uh, a while. I'm gonna cast light on a pebble and see if I can throw it, if it lights up anything. Uh, it doesn't illuminate anything else. There are several of these little squid things still swimming around. Hmm, and it looks like it goes back up? Like, how far in does it go back up? Um, it, it, it's kind of hard. It kind of just starts to slant up a little bit at the edge of your vision. Uh -huh. Does it look like it's an, uh, a ramp? Or just like a, a wall? It like seems get... to be a natural formation. Uh -huh. it, okay, I I know you said it, all I can really see is slanting, but if I really squint my eyes, can I tell if it's another like exit entrance? Or is it like, if we go you there, we're just going to be stuck there. Okay. Shit. Well, who is faster? If I cast Expeditious Retreat, you can technically dash twice in a turn. Uh, I have a speed of 30, 30 feet. Yeah, okay, 30. swim like swim speed, right? Because you're a triton, yeah, so if I cast Expeditious Retreat and Sanctuary, that'd be two spell slots, and you can get there very safely within the minute. Very easily. You will be literally going like uh, one and a half times as fast. Okay, okay. All right. Uh, what do you think? Let's try it out. Let's try it out. All right. I uh, I'm gonna cast uh, expeditious. Uh, oh, expeditious retreat is only on self. Welp. All right, buddy. I looks like I'm gonna have be ha have to be the one that's gonna is gonna take the uh, the risk then. Uh, let me see. Are are they still around? If I uh, could, yeah. could we bend the rules and have it where if I touch him, I can cast expeditious retreat. Uh. I don't think so. <laughs> Damn. All right. But make an Arcana check. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, fucking. What's my Arcana? Uh, oh, better than I thought. Okay. I have a plus six to Arcana. Forgot because I'm an Artisifer. <laughs> I was like, oh, 10. That's uh, 16, actually. <laughs> six? Yeah, sure. Go for it. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, all right. Then I cast Expeditious Retreat and then I cast Sanctuary. So, have fun. Okay, I'm gonna jump in. All right, you uh, dive into the water, and uh, your vision is surrounded with these bubbles. And then quickly, uh, they float up to the surface, and you swim down this cave rapidly. 
Um, several of these squids attempt to run towards you. Some of them do and then turn around, but a couple of them make it through. And uh, you get a couple cuts and scratches. Also, you take six piercing damage. Uh, and then you eventually coming to the to the end of the tunnel. Uh, well, the tunnel, the, this cave seems to keep going, but uh, eventually you can see the water uh, comes into, there's some air above it. And you coming up out of it, realize you're in an underwater river of sorts. Uh, around you on either side is kind of a cavern, a small cavern, um, with two separate caves that uh, on dry land that seem to go on and a bridge over the little tunnel. And sitting on the other side of the bridge is a stone slab uh, stained with blood and candles. Oh, mm. no. Okay. That's the I'm not trying to do nothing. Darn it. I'm going to have to get uh, Mickey down here. So I'm going uh, to explore. Sworn... I'm a oh, wait. Do, what do I see? Like, do I see the, the woman? Do I see anything on the bridge? You don't uh, see anyone. You should see, have one of my nobody? pebbles with light somewhere over there you can grab on the way up and, like, use it for, like, a light source. You'd have to I swim back to get it, no. Yeah, uh, you do have dark vision, that's true. Oh, yeah, dark vision. I can see the dark. The, the oh. little uh, tunnel was probably about a uh, hundred feet long, by the way. <laughs> oh, okay. thank God I had Expeditious Retreat then. It only took you one turn to get there. Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. Imagine if it was two turns. Oh. Ooh. Well, you know, I had word of rage if they would have got... Oh, they did the crap. I didn't use never mind. Okay. There's nobody there. No, you don't see anyone at the moment. Do you have message or anything? I do not have massage. I oh, just have Percy in there. Percy, go check on him. Ah, uh, Swim? Uh, are you only able to get in there if you swim, buddy? Uh, yeah, it's an underwater cave. You'd have to swim to go through. Oh. Okay, uh, he doesn't exactly have much health. Let me see. How much health does he have? Uh, I mean, he has 14. He could take a hit. Yeah, go check He'd also him. be going quite slow. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Expeditious retreat on a parrot? I mean... <laughs> yeah, you could try. Oh, I should have sent him with you. What's his What's his walking speed? Because it would be half of that. Uh, let me check. Okay. It's mm, probably like... 20. Yeah, so he'd swim 10 feet a sec. So it would take him 10 rounds to go through. Wow, and he'll take six, 66 per round. He is dead. Yeah. Or, or 64 per round. Yeah, uh, never mind. <laughs> Percy. That's Percy. a lot of damage. Yeah, Percy, Percy, Percy. I don't think you could physically last ah, that. Ah, here I go. No, no, Percy, stay here. Per Percy. Hey, ah, Percy, okay. get, get your ass back here. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, I hope he's fine. Uh, I'm going to start walking uh, around the island, trying to f explore for other entrances and shit. Okay, yeah, um, you start walking. I need to investigate. Um. Because I'm not going down there. <laughs> Corvus, or Convos, what, yeah. what are you doing while he does this? I'm going to try to sneak up out the water and just look around and make sure there's nobody there. Yep, or make a stealth and check. And, I, and if I see any exits. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, there are the two other caves I described before. They're up on dry land. And I have a plus zero to my tail. Okay. I got a nat 20. <laughs> nat 20? All right. <laughs> Fucking yeah, you ninja. you dive out of this water without even making a ripple and land on the stone. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to go to one of the X's. Well, I'm going to look down there make sure I don't see nobody. So okay, yeah. Places. So... One of them uh, has faint torchlight uh, coming from it. The other one uh, has nothing. Okay, I'm not going to go down that one because I'm, I'm going to go down the one with the faint torchlight. Oh, yeah. There will be people. All right. So um, with your 20 stealth, you start creeping along this hallway. It kind of bends. Uh, it starts to turn, and you peek your head around the side and see two robed figures uh, holding torches and... Uh, one holds a scimitar, one holds a short sword. They're just kind of looking uh, in, your, in your direction. They seem to be guards. Ooh. Okay. So get the jump on I'm them. Going to, I'm going to finally use my round shape, and I'm going to turn to a giant wolf spider. <laughs> All right. All right, then. <laughs> you know? And I'm going to 
spider climb sneakily up the wall. Oh, but they doesn't see me. <laughs> okay. Um, so this is not a large you... spider, right? This is just like a, a normal little spider. It is. How big is it? If, cause if it doesn't say large, the giant one or the or the little one. Yeah, I don't think you have the uh, the challenge ready kinds. to do giant. All I can do is giant wolf spider. Yeah, that's all it is. Wait, giant wolf spider? Yep, medium beast. Yep. Damn. Okay, With so it's an X, actual combat yeah. form then. Yep, and I got a plus five and six. Yeah, so you're about the size of a dog, probably. Uh, by that plus oh, five, I'll have to you make another. Mm. Yeah, I'll have you make another stealth check as a spider yeah. now. Oh, so are you gonna try to sneak I, past them? I, yeah, I don't want them to see me. I'm gonna try to. Smart, uh, smart. Yeah. That's the big That's brain good. play. <laughs> Sixteen plus five. Twenty-one. Holy shit. Twenty-one. Okay. Twenty-one. All right. You mm -hmm. kind of blend in with the shadows and rocky kind of uneven surface of the ceiling to the point where they don't even see you. Um, and walking into the room beyond. Uh, it opened into another kind of small cavern. Uh, it's only about 30 by 30 feet. Uh, and there are three more of these uh, men in cloaks. And another one, this one's not wearing a cloak. He's wearing a breastplate and holding a trident. And um, interestingly enough, he seems like at, at some point he was human. But now looking closer with your eight eyes, um, one of his arms kind of wiggles it has it seems to have more joints than it should uh Ew. almost like it's a tentacle and it, it stretches far god damn it is this an arm. eldritch horror game is that it and no and uh one of his one of his legs uh is normal but the other one is several different legs these kind of more oh. squid like appendages as for the room, oh, no. uh, there, there's a couple of bookshelves and another. There's the way you came. Uh, there's a ladder in the back, and there's another way uh, to your left. Hey, Convos, I have a question. Yeah. Should I go get a cannon? <laughs> yeah, you'd probably finish your loop around the island about this point. You wouldn't see anything <laughs> else interesting. Wait, so there's no <laughs> other way to get down there. I'll make a perception check. We'll see. Okay. Let's you see. Find anything. Not 20! Not 20? <laughs> I use my new dice. I got these blue dice for the pirate campaign. Okay. Uh, yeah, you make your way around, and then coming back to where you started, uh, you stub your toe on something. Uh, as, this, <laughs> uh, as this happens, you look down, and you see a trapdoor that's extremely well disguised. Uh, uh, oh, shite! Out of my fucking... And as this oh, happens, oh, hello there! Corvus, or... I, I said that wrong again. Uh, Are you just combos. Combos. You hear kind of a, a uh, from the ladder. Okay. Did <laughs> I they open it. Notice it? Like, did, like, did they notice? Uh, yeah, they turn around and kind of look at it. I tell open it. Weapons. You open it? Yeah. Uh, huh. Hello there! Suddenly, <laughs> light streams into this room. And they kind of stumble backwards uh, with their weapons raised. They draw their weapons and kind of... One of them goes... Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, what was that? You cut out. What did you do? It screeched. <laughs> oh, ee! Okay, got you. Uh, I'm just going to say, What are you shmicky mahal? Can you help me? <laughs> Roll initiative. Okay. <laughs> That's a plus zero on initiative. God. So and while I was doing my loop, could I have like brought my cannon since I made that joke? <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Damn. Well, because it's like a cannon, like it moves at my speed. Yeah, but you'd have to go all the way back to the ship. It would have taken you much, much longer. Oh, okay. Uh, never mind. Don't then. worry. They don't know. Because you, you'd have to get in the rowboat, get in the water, sail over. Oh yeah. Ship, get, get your thing into it. Come all the way back and then go over. Yeah, here. you're right. Never mind. Uh, that's cool then, because I have my infusions, because technically my, but technically my equipment is a plus one, because of my infusion, so I'm good. Alright, let's see. Uh, that's a 16 in initiative. I got a 19 in initiative. Would I get sneak, like, uh, advantage right. on the chat, since they don't know I'm there? Yeah, I'll, I'll give you a surprise round. Uh, just give me a second to do these. Oh, BT dubs, I totally forgot. Uh, I have armor of tools, repeating shot. 
which means uh, our throwing, uh, our ranged weapons, I can give a plus one bonus. Returning weapon, my throwables, my boomerangs are plus one. Oh, I should have been, uh, I should have told you about that. I could have been upgrading you. <laughs> All right. We're going to have to kill the, um, the list octopus squid <laughs> <laughs> oh, the money should make you make how huh, can you help me? And I'm just like, I'm, I'm just fired. I'm just All right. my, my uh, I'll give you your surprise. Do you have, so you have one round uh, if you want to do something. Okay. Is it just Converse? So did they, did they yeah, start for, going? Yeah. yeah, makes sense. But they're not surprised by you. <laughs> uh, no, they, they haven't moved yet. Okay, it's just so as the trap door opens and he shouts into the hole, you have a split second to do some things. Okay, well, I'm going to crawl down. All right. And cast something. You're, I'll say you're right over uh, one of the ones in robes. Uh, if you walk forward 10 okay. feet, you're, you'd be right over. Uh, you should the not climb down. One. You should just cast a spell like Fog Cloud or a Guiding Bolt. Fuck him up. Can you cast a spell while in Polymorph? Uh, do you. As a, which, I don't think so. Which circle did you go into? Circle of the coast. Damn, nah. Now, if, so if you go Shepherd, nope. your wild shapes become better. So I get a melee attack on... Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll just say you drop down onto... Who do you want to attack? The one on the left. Do you want to do the squid man or one of the guys... Squid that's man. Fuck him up. Oh, the squid man. I'm going to do the squid man. We got to get All some right. damage on him. You drop directly onto the squid man. Ow! Ah! Yeah. <laughs> Plus two hit. Hit. Okay. Wait, what's your damage, 1D. real quick? <laughs> I get a 1d6 plus 1 piercing, and target must make a dc11 constitution. Ooh. It might be Baby better throw. if you unmorphed and then cast, like, Thunder Wave. Fuck all three of them up. I think it's an action to come out of it. Nope, it's bonus me. action. Bonus action? Yep, yep. To come out. Not to go in, but to come out. Mm -hmm. So you could do 3d8 to three of them. And send them flying. Help old Mickey out. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. Okay, while I'm dropping, oh, dude, turn away as soon as I hit, land right beside the squid man. Uh, that's a yeah. Is that like a cone? How so? Con check. Constitution have to be. And it's a uh, 15 feet around him. Okay, yeah. I'll say you can hit three of the uh, cultists as well. Then there's still the two by the tunnel that we're guarding. Sweet. Uh, that that don't get hit, and they all make con saves. Yep, yep. Okay. Mm Wait, did you just say three? Like, there's three cultists? Yeah, yeah, there's three with robes in the room with the squid man, and there's the two that we're guarding. I didn't know that. <laughs> okay, I thought it was the one. Okay. <laughs> no, boo, we got a lot. That's why I was like, we should definitely do multiple targets. <laughs> uh, okay. So, so it's like Constitution 12 saving throw, I believe, right? Yep. Mm hmm. Give me a second. I'm rolling. Okay, so the squid man gets a seven. He fails. I nice. Right. Yep. Woo. And the cultists get, uh, looks like two of them fail. The other one gets a 17. Okay, so he will, he will only get half. Okay, so what's your damage? It is 11, and the two that fail are pushed 10 feet away from me. Okay, so all but one of them are pushed away. Uh, let yeah. me put damage down so he has two get 11 and one get half there we go that's how you think like uh like a lavender all right I yeah so it. It was so as you as you drop uh down from the roof uh and uh, unmorphing as you do you land on your feet and then kind of putting pushing your arms out to either side uh you send this, these bolts of crackling electricity that hits um, the big squid man in the chest, sending him flying back into the rock, and he takes a little bit of damage from that. And then the other two are simply pushed backwards and uh, kind of land on the ground and roll and stand up. Uh, the other one, just the lightning strikes the ground at his feet, and he takes a little bit of damage from that. And then we're going to go top of the round with uh, you again. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> Kicking ass. <laughs> yeah, that was yeah. the surprise round, and then now we're in for turn order. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. I am going to cast... Uh, oh, wait, he's not even in there yet. For a bonus action, I'm going to cast Shield of Faith on myself. <laughs> and All right. I am going to Guiding Bolt 
the squid man. Hell yeah! Oh right. yeah! Is that a save or anything? No, I got a row to hit. He gets a oh, huge okay. set of bonuses though for it. Holy Which shit! Which is seventeen. Seventeen hits. Damn. Four D six radiant damage, and that is nine. Nine damage. Mine. Oh wow! I didn't know that you get. Adv oh sorry, I'm just reading this spell because I like to read. Uh, but I didn't realize you get advantage on your next hit on the target too. Wow. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. That's an awesome spell. What did I cast? Shield of Faith. Okay, which means that my plus two bonus now. So sixteen. Now I get why you went now. cleric. Holy shit. Yes. So now my armor class is eighteen, and that is all I'm doing. All right, then. Uh, next up will be the three uh, cultists that were in the room. So they are going to... Uh, <laughs> the two that were struck by your uh, lightning okay. are going to... I like how you said that's all I'm doing. Like you did, like, eh, casual shit. You didn't just, like, <laughs> kick ass in the round or nothing. They're going to run oh, forwards and attempt to stab you with their uh, sickles and short swords. So okay. let's see here if these hit. Uh, the first one is a 16 to hit. Nope, I got 18. Okay, the other one misses as well. Uh, and then the last guy is go. He'll do the same. He's gonna run off and attempt to stab you. Uh, that's a nat one. Uh, he trips and he's now prone. And then it is going to be um, your turn, Robot Man. Oh, thank you. Oh, he's lucky. My name's my name's Mickey. Thank you very much. Um. Oh, fuck. Uh, it's about 15 I... feet down uh, the ladder. Thank you. Down into the room. Awesome. I just realized, I was looking at my sheet, and I realized I my whole thing for combat is that cannon. That's that's what my class is, or subclass is. And, uh, ooh, I left it on the ship, so now I'm trying to think about what I can do. Uh, <laughs> whoo, yep, we should probably, because that's an extra 48 damage every round on my ac bonus action. <laughs> that that's don't get me wrong, badass during a like like a cannon fight Ooh, trying to get away. But oh god, okay. Um, is this Squidman still up? Sorry, I was trying to type something. Yeah, out. he's fine. No one's died yet. Okay, how how's the Squidman looking? He looks mostly unfazed. Uh, t the two that were struck by the two uh, lesser cultists that were struck by lightning uh, are slightly damaged. All right, well that's just not gonna do then. Okay, uh, I need to hurt him. All right, well um. Since I'm 15 feet up, can I jump down to strike the uh, the squid guy? <laughs> yeah, you know, the ladder isn't close enough to him, but you can jump down rather than climbing. I'll let you make an acrobatics check. Uh, if, if that's what you want to do. I'll just say that takes five yeah. feet of movement. And awesome. we'll see if you take damage 18. or not. 18's fine. You, you land and roll and stand up. <sighs> I'm uh, here. You're about 10 feet away from Squidman. All right, then I'll, I'll run up to him with my great club and hit him. All right, roll to hit. <laughs> uh, that's going to be a nat 20. What? Uh, that hits. Awesome. Then he's going to take a fucking walloping right now. Okay, that's max plus four, so that's 12 plus one from my infusion. That's 15 damage. All right, sweet. Wait, sorry, did I say fifty? No, I said twelve. Huh. He, uh, he's looking yeah. about. He's looking bloodier at this point. <sighs> uh, then for my bonus action, um, do I have a spell I can do that will help us here? That is a bonus. No, no, I do not. All right, cool. That will. Uh, oh, I'll tell uh Percy to go uh to attack him. Oh, sweet. Percy, and then I'll roll for him. I have his stats right here. Uh, if you want to look at them, they're on my page. If you go to extras under Percy. Uh, so Percy is super cool uh, because he is. Uh, so this isn't his actual stats. He's a uh, artista for homunculus, which actually mm -hmm. means he can do a magic blast. Uh, he channels my magic, and he does. Oh, that's a nat twenty for Percy. <laughs> All right, roll your damage. Awesome. Do you want to do critical hit decks, or do you want to stick with uh, this? Uh, I'll just, I'll do this for now. Okay. Good, cool. Uh, six plus, uh, that's eight more damage from Percy. Sweet. 
Uh, and then on for his bonus action, he'll take evasion, uh, which is going to make him harder to hit, but he's going to be up close trying to distract the uh, squid man. Okay. Booga booga. <laughs> there you go, and that's my turn. Uh, is that a melee or ranged attack? Uh, range. Okay. It's, it's not two range. It's like a 10 foot range. It's like air quotes okay. range. <laughs> Uh, alright then. The two guards are now going to spring into action. Uh, okay, seeing what's happening, they're gonna run out of the tunnel towards, uh... Towards Convos and make some attacks. Whew. <laughs> that is a 13 and a... Five. I'm rolling terribly. Yeah, my goodness, <laughs> dude. Lucky oh, you. They my, you somehow you something. dodge and weave out of all these attacks. And then the big squid man is going to go. We're just too He's good. Going, I, ha I have disadvantage on attacking your bird, right? Yep. Okay. He's going to uh, pull, pull back his trident and then uh, throw it forward into the where the bird is. Okay, he, I got a nine and a four. <laughs> he misses. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, uh, all right. That's, uh, then he'll take his other attack again at, at the bird. Oh, sweet. Uh, does a 20 hit the bird? Yeah, that, that, I don't even have to check. That hits Percy. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's going to take... Percy, no! <laughs> no, 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 no. I, mean, I can literally on our long rest just remake Percy. It's fine. <laughs> or oh no, or I can take a minute to revive him. That's right, because uh, he's a clockwork uh, device. Three piercing damage. Oh, that's nothing. I'm doing terribly. <laughs> yeah, that's my rolls are so bad. Uh, and then it's back <laughs> to the top of the round. Kick their ass, Convos. You got him. Okay. So who's near me again? It, like all of them? <laughs> yeah, so you've got five of the little cultists surrounding you. Thunder and wave? the big man is a, a, a little ways away next to... About ten feet away next to uh, Mickey. Okay. I might send Percy the Thunder Wave for you. <laughs> oh, no, I'm going to do it again. <laughs> I'm going to Thunder Wave. Use my all right. Flat. That's deck saves? Or, no, yeah. con saves. Yeah, con saves. Oh my god. We we have the perfect setup to fuck these guys up. This is <laughs> amazing. Okay, so that is a... Uh, let's see. There's a nat 20 in there. And Oof! The lowest one is a a 16. Wow, so they take half damage then, huh? Half damage. Wow, they all, they all pass. That is I insane. A, that made it up for my other rolls. <laughs> oh, wow. 19, 15, 14, 13, and 17. You know what? That's fair. We've been doing so well that they deserve that. So that would be 13. So have 13. So six damage. That's still a good amount for these guys. Yeah, it is. That's still impressive. Good job, Convo. That's. I'm surprised. I didn't expect that. Uh, that so, okay, yeah. That probably would have like shout, hurt. <laughs> and and again, uh, you, you you describe it. So I'm just gonna look at them. All uh -huh. right. Put my triton, I'm gonna hit in the ground, I'm gonna put my hands together and shout, Pow! <laughs> Oh, wow. Alright. This is my last name. <laughs> and then lightning shoots out of you, and they all are, are stunned for a second as these bolts of electricity uh, shoot through them. And then three of them are going to attempt to stab you again. Uh, actually, two of them are going to attempt to stab you again. Hit me, please hit me. Hit me. Please do hit. Uh, all right, 19 to hit on one of them. Okay, he hit, and he's gonna, and he's gonna have to make a dex saving throw. Okay. <laughs> uh, you take seven piercing, and dex save is a 17. Okay, he will only take half. So that's two d eight. Oh, is that Hellish Rebuke? No, that's um, uh, Storm Sorcerer. Wrath it's... of the Storm. Oh yeah. my goodness. 11. So half of 11. Uh, five. Okay, so five. Uh, and you take your eight piercing? Yep. Yep. All right. Nice. Uh, and then the other one is going to break off and simply run back down the hallway. God damn it, we gotta kill him quick. Uh... And then it's going to be Mickey. How do I then? 
Uh, the guy who's running down the hall. Okay, uh... Are the ones around Convo still alive? All uh, good, healthy looking? Too healthy looking? Yeah, there's there's four... One, yeah, there's four around him, one of them is running. Okay, I'm gonna send Percy in the middle with uh, Convos, and through him, uh, he's gonna, using his turn, he's gonna use my magic to cast Thunder Wave. Okay. Oh no! <laughs> so, uh, no, it's not gonna hurt you, don't worry, it's, it, it hurts everyone but my allies. So, those four can make a con save at a much harder DC now. Yeah, it's, it, the uh, the homunculus is pretty cool, right? He can use my magic. It is. Uh, so the highest was a twenty. I assume he passes. The yep. rest were eleven and lower. Yeah, and, uh, con fourteen. So All only right, one so passes. Three of them fail. Great. So I'm gonna help Convos here with ten plus my thing. So uh, fourteen damage. Seven for the guy who passed. Okay. And it, uh, as a boombox comes off of Percy's back and a screech, caca. <laughs> okay, so two of them die. Uh, Great. One of them's looking. The other two are looking really low. And then for my turn, because that was Percy's, uh, I can only use my action because I gave him my bonus action. Uh, I'm going to take my plus one boomerang and I'm just going to fucking try to knock the guy out that's running away. Yeah, roll the hit. Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm not kidding, not 20. <laughs> Alright, roll your damage. Woo! Alright. I rolled a nat 20 yet, so fine. <laughs> fine. Ooh, baby. We got some good luck right now. <laughs> uh, That's 12 points of damage. Three. Uh, He's not unconscious yet. Ah. He looks pretty hurt, though. Uh, he's uh, kind of st staggering as he runs. Is my nat 20 uh, not able to hit him in the leg or something? Cripple him a little bit? <laughs> no, unfortunately. No. Damn. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, all right. And Thank you. And then the squid man uh, hefts his trident and uses it to kind of bat at uh, you. Uh, and uh, you parry. And he uses the opportunity to run towards his companion. Uh, they both start fleeing down this hallway now. God damn it. Uh, and then the two uh, that are near you are... Uh, Convos are going to once again strike. Okay. The first one is a 18 to hit. Oh, God. My AC. If only I had one more spell slot. Okay, so the, other one hits. the other one is 16, so that misses. Okay. So you take uh, three piercing, and <laughs> he needs to make a deck save. No, no, I, I, I only can do it on it once. Oh, okay. Per round. All right. So I, I already used my reaction. Then that's the end of their turn, and it's back to you, Convos. Convos, okay, take out the guys running away. <laughs> so there's two, there's <laughs> two people face. right up in your face, and there's the squid man and one other guy running down the hall. I don't have... Okay. Well, I'm going to cast Cure Wounds on myself because I am about to die. How bad are you? Right. Bro, that... Yeah, they was they been whipping my ass. Oh, so you only have 24 yeah. hit points. Oh, my. Yeah. I, I so forgot. I got 11 back. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Eight. Oh, my goodness. Eight. Damn it. Wait. <laughs> I'm trying. Uh, oh, Lord. It's the wrong box. Okay. <laughs> okay, I had to put it back. I kept doing damage. <laughs> so, how far away are these guys? The squid man's about, let's see, he'd be 15 feet. The other one is 30 feet, and he's about to go around the corner. Uh, I will say, no. though, since since you have someone within five feet of you, you have disadvantage in ranged attacks. Yeah, just take care of yourself. Beat those guys. Oh, okay. Uh, but you have used your action for cure wounds, though. Yeah. Know. That's true. So, what do you have that you can do for your bonus action? Oh, a weapon attack. <gasps> nice. That's true. Two weapon so fighting. Just, there we go. I'm going to just try to hit the other guy. <laughs> All right. Roll the hit. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll say you hit the weaker one, the one that's lower on health. Okay. Nice. Oh, damn it. Which is 
1d6 piercing damage, which is four. Four total? Yep. Okay, he's not quite out yet, but he's on his last legs. Nice. God damn it. You guys are pretty tough, man. Oh Holy uh, shit. This, was this supposed to be, like, a lot harder and we're just happen to be doing pretty well? It's pretty much what I expected. You are doing really well, though. Okay. Uh, Almost died, so. I, I was expecting you to go about it differently. Uh, the way you did kind of means you will you had to take more damage. True. Uh, and then uh, the guy that's running goes around the corner and you can no longer see him at the moment. And then it's Matt, M Mick's turn. Mickey's turn. <laughs> Mick, that's an offensive turn, my friend. <laughs> um, Alright, let me see. Okay, oh gosh, what am I going to do? Um, I'm going to take my Great Club, and I suppose I will try to, uh... I'll have Percy try to kill the one that's low, and I'll take the one around on Convos that is not as low. Okay. So for Percy, that is a... Uh... 17 a hit. That hits. Yay. Uh, that is a... <laughs> 6 damage. Okay. He is dead. And then I will not do nearly as well as my bird. Uh, <laughs> that will be 16 a hit. 16 hits. Awesome, possum. Seven damage. Seven damage. All right. Uh, all right. He's looking hurt. Uh, he's he's near death. And does that end your turn? Yeah, that's all I got. Okay. Uh, the one you just you just hit, Mickey, is going to swing at you. This is <laughs> a come on, you right bastard. Uh, eighteen to hit. That hits. And you take six piercing damage. Ouchies. <laughs> and then Squidman is going to turn around. He shouts something. Do, do either of you, do any of you know deep speech? I do. Oh, let me think. Nope, I do not. Uh, he says in kind of a jarbled voice, it sounds like, it sounds kind of like bubbly. I don't know how to describe it, but uh, he says, Don't let them follow us. Go, <laughs> follow us. Yeah. <laughs> and then what he did continues he say? running. He said, don't let us follow say? him. Let's go follow him. Okay, follow him. Damn right. <laughs> can we just quickly off this guy in front of us so we can follow him? Uh, Yeah, it's back to you, Convos. Awesome. Come on, stab this guy. <laughs> I'm just going to hit him. I'm not going to let this fail. I'm just going to hit him. With my, uh, with my trident. Huh? 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 <laughs> <laughs> With your plus two to hit. 15. Ooh. 15. <laughs> nice. 15 hits? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, that hits. And it's five damage. Ooh. Okay, he's on his last legs. <sighs> you keep barely... <laughs> All right, <laughs> bonus action finish him. I keep thinking, oh, you'll finish him now. That was my bonus action. That was your... Wait, what, what, what you did you do for your... your action. Yeah, you can use your action. Yeah, your action. I, can use, I can use my action. That's my bonus action. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I'll, I'll, we'll talk about this in camp. This is kind of funny. We'll talk about it in the campfire. Uh, <laughs> it's it's just, kind of funny what's happening on land. I'm going to just storm strike him. Just, eh, die. <laughs> Which is a cancer if I have my blood. All right. Uh, and then is that 15 again. That hits. He's dead. Okay. Did he have like one fucking health? Yeah, he had one health. That is so oh dumb. So okay. dumb. <laughs> uh, and then... If you enjoyed that episode, then look for more at youtube.com slash wolfer28, Spotify at Building a Guild of Adventures, or if you really want to watch us record our stories in person, or maybe our DMs write for our sessions or build maps, join us at Twitch at the Guild of Adventures. Thank you very much, and have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye.